going on swing trader just getting over my cold right here still got it a little bit but today i'm going to do prpo this is a penny stock and uh it's a pretty low penny stock um i'm more or less going to think about day trading this and not swing trading it because i don't want to hold it very long and i'm going to get into why but i uh, just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel like this video if you enjoy it and let's get right into prpo so this stock had some news come out on april 3rd precipio has been selected to use its testing laboratory for molecular hematology hope i said that right i'm horrible with words and this is basically for faster high quality testing which can also lead to better patient care and this can generate recurring annual revenues between 50 to 100k for precipio so this is really good news for the company and that's what's boosting this stock right now so this stock has been through zero reverse splits, so that's good so far. Price target on this stock is $20. I really don't even see it getting close to this unless it has an RS. So this is the reason right here I'd be very cautious on holding this stock. The company had until March 25th of 2019 to get to a dollar, and of course they didn't. So they have 30 to 40 days from this date to get to a dollar. And if not, it definitely is gonna go into an RS. And this is why I'm saying, I don't think it's a really good idea to be holding this stock because if you're not really paying attention to it and if you're not looking at your emails, they could RS this thing pretty quickly and you'd be out. That's why personally, I'm just thinking about day trading this stock. Here's a look at the company's website right here. All right, I got the chart pulled up for PRPO here. See it ran up really nicely today and then I had a little pullback right here. Let me zoom in. And it seems to be holding right above the 20 period. That's a really good sign that the stock is very bullish right now. Let me go ahead and transfer to the 180 day four hour just so I can find some resistance here. So we have support and resistance. So I don't think this is a pump and dump even though it looks like one because this stock is running off of very good news. So what I'm planning on doing tomorrow when the market opens at 930 is to let this stock play out a little bit and wait for the first pullback. And once that pullback happens then I make sure it's not a complete dump out of it. Then I'm gonna go ahead and get into this stock and I'm gonna get out of it in that same day. And with a four hour chart, you can see the volume is one big green stick and then one medium sized red one. So tomorrow's gonna to be a little bit interesting on this stock. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and day trade this one. I don't wanna swing trade it because I don't wanna hold it because I don't know when the RS is gonna happen because I don't see the stock getting over a dollar in the time period that they have. So yeah, just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel, like this video if you enjoyed it and uh, let's make some money on this one, yeah!